So, I've done some more stuff to the off-road go-kart, and I'm just going to go through pretty much everything that I did. That Some of it's on video, some of it's not, and then I'm going to take it for a test drive. So that's in this episode of the off-road go-kart build. first thing I did is I started boarding it up so I have a board on the top and the front they're not mounted they're just resting there just to just testing out you know I'm gonna mount them a little bit later but I still have to board the triangles up over here the bottom I'm gonna need a big board for that I'm still looking and then these triangles in the corner I'm gonna board those up and I'm gonna paint those all black I think Maybe. I, don't, I, don't, I haven't decided yet. I might leave them white. Depends. I'll probably do them black, black with the rest of the frame. So what I've also done is mounted this. Just welded that in place to hold the steering rack. The steering rod there. And then these steering rods. This one we had to shorten, but it's sketchy. We just welded on a little bracket right there. But I'm going to fix that a little bit later. So we got it, so now when you, you turn the wheel, it's hard to do when it's not moving, but the wheels do turn. Um, also started hooking up the brakes, as you can see here. Um, but the front brakes don't work, so I'm going to have to, like, even... I need to make a little stopper. A hose clamp isn't working for here. And I need to disassemble the front brakes and clean them up, because right now they just don't work at all. So... When I go on my test drive, I just hooked up a wire, tied a bow in in the end to the disc brake, and I'm just going to use that to brake. Works not that great, but it's fine. I also mounted the Honda GX200 with the torque converter. Um, I just used the sprocket that was there, so I don't really know how many teeth it has. And yeah, I have wood as the seat for now. Hooked up the throttle cable. So that's where everything is at now. There's still a lot more to do, but I'm going to go for a drive in it and hopefully not crash too bad. Hasn't been started for a while.
<laughs> the steering arm broke. Look. Oh no. Link. The steering link that uh as you can see it's not working. I mean it sort of works. It worked enough to get me back, but it's definitely gonna need to be like a solid rod, so I need to get a new one for hardcore off-roading. pretty cool. The brakes don't work at all. The axles are crooked. Your front axle. Oh yeah, the front needs to be aligned. The wheels are like sideways. It was fun Especially though. Especially that one. Yeah. It needs to be aligned, but it's fine. I think it works pretty well. It's pretty cool. It needs a lot of work still. Should park it next to the Acura. Nah. Park <laughs> it next to the Mini. Yeah. It's about the same size. <laughs> Alright. So that's all for this video, and we'll see you in the next one.